Hey guys, welcome to Engineers Escape. My name's Jake and today I'm going to be answering your questions about the upgraded batteries. Okay, so since I first made this video, many of you guys have had questions about these batteries and uh, different things, so I'm just going to go through them right now with you. Okay, so the first question I have, how do I make the battery able to connect to the drone? Spade connectors? And yes, so they're just the spade connectors with uh, slightly bent out ends and they slide right on these connectors here. And over here on this end, in case you're wondering, these are just like banana connectors or bullet, bullet connectors. So the next question I have is, does the original battery still fit? You can see all I did was take off the plastic on this side and I left this other side intact. So since I only took it off of this side here, the other battery, the original, still fits in there just fine and snaps into place. Because it's just really snapping onto this lip down here and this other lip up here. So here's the original battery. And you can see that it slides in and snapped in quite nicely. All right, the next question that I've got asked a lot is where do I get these batteries or where do I get the charger for the batteries? And all the links to those are in the description, but I just got these from eBay, these batteries as well as the charger. And you use any kind of 7.4 volt uh, 2S LiPo battery? Uh, no, you actually have to do a small calculation. But this one is more than enough with a 60C rating and 4200 milliamp hours. You have to multiply the C rating, 60, by the milliamp hours, 4200. It gives you your, your uh, maximum continuous safe discharge rate for this battery. A couple comments that I've gotten also. Uh, people are worried that this is going to burn the motors out by using a different battery, and that's a valid concern. Uh, what you have to understand, though, if you have the same voltage, the amount of current that it's going to be supplying is going to be the same. Uh, the only difference is it's going to supply it for a longer time and let you have more flight time. Your milliamp hours is just kind of like your power bank, essentially. Does the app show the battery charge level like the original? Does automatic return to home on critical battery level still work with a non-original battery? Yes, it does. Auto land. I also wanted to show you guys this. Uh, I'm using this instead of the rubber band now. Uh, it was available on Thingiverse, so I went ahead and downloaded it. And I had one of my buddies who had a 3D printer print it. And again, this the only purpose this serves is kind of just to hold the battery in place. But once again, you can easily just use a rubber band. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, I'd appreciate it if you left a like. And uh, consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.